Yo, it's Shaka DG, and today I'm going to be going over some tips for beginners who may be picking up the game for the new season or trying out the free weekend that's out now. So tip number one, we should talk about operators and which ones you should try learning first. So I'll give you a few operators for both attack and defense that you can try learning first. So let's start with some attacking operators first. I'd recommend trying out Ash, Sledge, Buck, and lastly Zofia. So for the defender operators, I'd recommend that you start out with Rook, Ella, Legion, and Vigil. And the reason that I say all those operators specifically is because of their gadgets are very simple and easy to understand, making it really easy for you to learn. So now that we've gone over what operators you should play, I want to go over map knowledge. Map knowledge in Siege is one of the most important things you should be trying to learn as a new player. With the destructibility in Siege, you need to know what room is below or above you, as well as what room is on the other side of the wall as you. This is very important because at any time, someone could come up and open up that floor or wall and just kill you. So this will, help, this will also help you be more confident with moving out through the map and understanding basic pushes and holds. So I'd recommend going to a custom game and learning each map one by one. Load in, run through each map until you feel comfortable with it, and then go in and learn another map. Another way you could do this is also to do T-Hunt. This way you can improve your aim and movement while you're learning the map. So you can run through T-Hunt, practice your crosshair placement, practice your aim, learn the maps. Um, but on number three, uh, I want to talk about TN a little bit. So TN's a great way to help improve your aim without actually playing ranked. This is also a good place to practice your crosshair placement like I was just talking about. Uh, so crosshair placement is going to be my third tip here. So crosshair placement in Siege is so important because of the one-shot headshot mechanic. So no matter what gun you're using, if you shoot one bullet into someone's head, they're going to die. So this means a lot of gunfights, whoever has the better crosshair placement will have the advantage. So if, you're aim if someone is aiming chest height but you're aiming head height there's a pretty good chance that you're going to end up winning that gunfight over the other person so be sure that you're going in to t-hunt and you're seeing where their heads are in comparison with the rest of the map and you're practicing your crosshair placement so for number four i want to go over how you should be playing an actual matchmaking game a big mistake i see newer players make is going is playing way too passive this game is much slower paced and tactical than others but that doesn't mean that you should never play aggressive so I'm mainly talking about the attacking side with this one. When you're attacking, you have three minutes to clear the map and plant the bomb. So a lot of new players will forget to use their drones, and they'll play very passive until 20 or 30 seconds left in a round. And then you're going to be forced to push into the site with very limited info. So when you're attacking, be sure to use your drones and push off your, your info that you gather, and don't play way too passive. Make sure you're playing aggressive. That brings us to my last tip of the video, and that is to use your utility. Now this goes for both the attacking and defending side. So while you're attacking, like I said, make sure to use your drones and your actual operator gadget to help you gather info and make a push for the site to get a plant down. But also while you're defending, you want to make sure that you're not only using your operator gadget, but you're also you're using your reinforcements, your barbed wire, shields, impact grenades, bulletproof cams, everything like that. So making sure you use your utility is key to winning the round and ranking up. That's all I have for today's video. I hope I was of some help to all you new players. If you guys have any other tips you'd like to put for the new players down in the comments, I'd appreciate it. But as always, thanks for watching. Okay, like with no issues, so... I don't know that I even want to do that. Hello, you playing Aqua? Does it look like an Aqua, bro? Are they in Aqua, or what's the situation? Uh, yeah. Who could Hey, well, I just... That, but they no. The door is not I'm even open. I'm still alive? Yeah, one second, I got you. Uh, I'm talking. Stop, stop. You would've gotten more health. Yeah. Oh my god! This guy just threw a nade into me! What are you doing, man? That's Buck dead. Can you heal me, bro? Yeah, Ryan's boosting us with his 0 and 1 right now. Coming in, study. Don't stand up. Got him. Baited him for you. You're getting boosted. There you go. Hey, we got a shotgun. Maverick dead. It could be dope. I hear him outside here. Nice 
Bait for me, bait for me, Ryan. For the full game Friday. Uh, I'm gonna just sit right here, okay? Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna keep smoking here. I don't think he's there. He's coming for me, he's coming for me. I'm really not. That's fucking quantum, holy shit. Coming for you, bitch. I got him, I got him, I got him. I can cut that out. It's not a full game Friday. I can just cut the audio. Still on a full game Friday. Missy J, boom. Missy J, boom. Missy J, Missy J, Missy J. Missy. Brian, you are such a fan. <laughs> I gotta make sure this work doesn't get the kill. I need us to have all the kills. No, look at look at this guy. Look at this guy baiting. No way he was just standing there. I'm out! You have left your spot. that guy once. I can kill him through the wall. I'm running out of ammo. How are you almost out of ammo, bro? It's like two minutes left. <laughs> He's literally just running over to the tree. You can shoot through the trees. No shit. Oh damn, I gotta stop. You literally have one defender secondary. Bro, I shot Thrasher in the head. He's behind the you car. Will be That's thermite. You remain in this area. Uh, he's behind the car. Nice. They're my dead. Oh, Where are the rest of them? Is that even a word? I hope they jump. Is that set a trophy? It sounds like. Oh, below you, yeah, below you, below you. Jumping. You have entered an enemy controlled area. Leave yeah, I just saw him. Second, I know. How do you not hear him? Why is he in spawn still? <laughs> if you remain in his zone, Peek me, bro! You have been spotted. Oh, I injured one. He's injured. Uh -huh. Uh, four. Last operator uh, standing. Oh. You have entered <laughs> I know I lit that guy up earlier. Yeah, well, I lit him up earlier. I wonder he didn't peek you, bro. Shock, you do not deserve to be alive right now. Why? <laughs> dude, the amount of I wasn't in this game. Button, dude. So Alright, so Kate, dude. <laughs> All you do is fucking hit the processing button. The processing button, okay. You hear this guy? Yeah, yeah, Who is Bloodbath? He, he, he's, a, he's a caster. He was a caster. And an, and an ex pro player when Cookies was an, uh, also a pro player. And then you make up shit to make me sound worse. Because you know how shit you are. Oh, Bam has died twice in a row on his one. Yeah, you cannot attack this fucking guy. This map is so good. I mean, yeah, he, he was really good on defense, but he's throwing. terrible on attack.